My name is Joe Marchetti. I'm 53 years old. I live in the town of Berkeley, Massachusetts. I'm a retired deputy chief from the Brockton, Massachusetts Fire Department. I was diagnosed with cancer in 2016 and uh, subsequently found out that my cancer would be due to PFAS contamination in my turnover. PFAS stands for per and polyfluoroalkyl substances. It's a really large class of chemicals uh, that have been around for um, probably 50 to 70 years. Um, they have a wide variety of properties and they're very useful in manufacturing and in products. Uh, it also turns out that they are quite hazardous and so they cause a variety of health effects from uh, liver effects and uh, endocrine effects. Some of them have been shown to cause cancer and these health effects can take shape at very low concentrations in what we are exposed to and consume. Uh, one year after my prostate was removed, I was diagnosed with skin cancer also. My initial reaction was disappointment because this was the gear that we used to allow us to penetrate further into burning buildings to save the civilians that we're, we have a duty to protect and, and rescue. And this was supposed to keep me safe during, that, during those events, but now I found out that it was causing me an illness. On average, once every three weeks, a Boston firefighter is diagnosed with some form of cancer. When we break it down, the problem to us becomes very simple. There is proven science that PFAS is a known carcinogen. There is also proven science that PFAS is in the protective gear that firefighters wear. They are still used because they do a really good job and because the standards have been built around them. So there are many uses of toxic chemicals where the standards employed by the military or by the government or by any other kind of standard setting organization, they were built around those chemistries. And so in order to meet those standards, you have to use those chemicals. It hurts. Uh, these guys and girls, they, they put their life at risk every day putting this stuff on, no matter what it is. Um, so to know that it's what they're wearing is hurting them in the long run, it's, um, they deserve better. 